Hey, good. Hey, guys. Uh, here's gonna be a good quality video um, of my X mod collection. As of um, today is uh, September something. I don't remember. But yep. Uh, so first up is my super lowered 350Z. Focus. There we go. It is extremely low. It is actually touching the ground with the front little lip. I wish it was a little bit brighter, but you can see it's very low. Here, I'll bring it out actually. Look how low that thing sits. It's sitting on an all-wheel drive Gen 1 chassis currently. Very low. Looks awesome. Sorry about the lighting in here, but yep. Uh, there's my 370. Um, next is my super lowered Scion TC. This actually, I'm pretty sure, is the lowest one in the world. For the fact that the current, the one, the current one that was lower, uh, it was you could fit an SD card under it. This one, hang on a sec. Whoa. We will take a business card, for instance, right here, and see if it'll fit. It is a tight fit. It hits it. it barely fits under the front. Okay, well, yep, you can see it's super lowered and looks sick. Uh, next is my Civic on a rolling chassis. If anybody has a pair of Civic taillights, they sell. I'm looking for some. Uh, but... It is on a stiletto chassis, gold stiletto chassis, no electronics, no batteries, uh, no servo. I'm thinking about putting a micro T electronics in it for out of this, my Raminator. Unless someone wants to buy this, it's up for sale. Um, yep, looks pretty sick. Next, my GTR project. Yes, I've made a little bit of progress. I took a break from pretty much all summer. But yep, I've pretty much finished this off. I just need to uh, paint it, and it's pretty much done. Yep, uh, next, my, uh, custom painted one, it's pretty good, it's a, a custom blue skyline, still same as last video, same as last video, same as last video, this is a project I did, um, it's a, uh, su um, skyline that I custom made decals for, this, this is up for sale as well, just the body, um, has custom made license plates. Come on, focus. There you go. You can see they say DRFT and they left out the I, so it's it's supposed to say drift. But yep, pretty sick looking. Custom front mounted license plate as well. Custom front bumper. This is not the wild front bumper. I have I I don't have the car with the wild front bumper. But the car with the wild front bumper it has more rounded grills. This is actually a stock middle piece with the outsides of a wild. Yep. Uh, next, my two black ones are the same. That's the same. My custom black 350. Bring that out. Custom rims. Looks sick. It's lowered. Ha uh, has exhaust pipes off of a Mustang. Uh, the taillights are not tinted, but since they're on black, they look tinted. So it's pretty sick. Yep. Um, next, some of you have seen this, some of you haven't, my blue 350Z. I picked this up, I traded my painted Subaru for it, mint condition, brand new, looks sick, I'm going to be getting a body kit for it. Um, next, my, ne my second rare is a silver skyline with a mild body kit. Sorry, I have to hurry up a little bit, I only have like six minutes left of video time. Looks seriously cool though. These rims are not up for sale. Don't ask, please. Thank you. Um, last but not least, my blue skyline. Yep, it looks sick, doesn't it? Wait, I put a car. Wait, when was that on there? Oh, wait. What? Does, does that have a body kit on it? Yep. Over here, guys. I picked this up from a guy that on a forum who helped me find the guy who had one. It is a XMOD 
Sky, uh, X Mod Body Kit for Skyline GTR. Notice, no price. That's because this was sold in Japan. And all the writing on it is in Japanese. Everything. The instructions are in Japanese. Everything. The only thing that isn't is this. Come on, focus. HPIRacing.com and SuperStreetOnline.com. Sorry if it's not focusing, but yeah. You can see it's all in Japanese. Amazing condition. Brand new body kit. I picked this up about, I got it on Wednesday this week. So yesterday I got this, actually. I swapped out the stock body kit and the stock hood and side skirts. Yep, but the rest of the body kit is mint in box. So this has actually never been taken out. The guy I bought it from had never used it. So what? these are my Skyline body kits and my extra Subaru one. I mean, not Super, Subaru. My red one, silver, and blue. I'm trying to find a black and yellow. If anybody has those for sale, I'd be interested in them. I would be willing to trade something for both of them. I'd be willing to trade uh, possibly one of the custom painted cars or something else. But yep. So here's what it looks like now with the custom bot with the sky with the mild body kit. It looks so nice. It's a actually a replica of that car that has the mild on it too. But it's a very nice looking car. Extremely rare. So guys please don't ask to buy it. it it's kind of offensive with some of the offers I've gotten for it so please don't bother. Um, let me go, let's go see what else I have in my box over here. Um, here's my other box. I have a my custom green super which was for sale and my uh, challenger which there was a guy who was going to buy and never did. Um, last but not least it's a project I've been working on. Here's my light. It is an XMOD truck. I'm still working on it. That's going to be a, either a toolbox or something. Uh, it, I still need to make the rear window, but it's coming along. It's for it's for a build off on XMOD's International their form. So I'm hopefully I'm going to enter it in that. Um, and here's the surfboard I'm going to be putting on it. I got the decals for it which actually I took out of another model kit I had laying around because I decided not to use the uh, decals for the kit. It's actually for a 37 Ford truck. So I'm going to be using these decals. Phil's Surf Shop. So it's going to be a surfboard truck. I mean, yeah. So it's going to be a truck. There's the model kit right over here. Let me bring it into the light. This is actually a model kit I've been working on. It's not finished yet. Color is really cool though. Yes, I'm sitting on top of my glass of water. It's kind of dusty right now, but the, the blue is very nice. That's actually not, that's blue painter's tape, but. Yep, let me get, and I'm not using the stock engine in it. I'm using the engine out of a uh, Ford, uh, uh, what is it, a, Mus a Ford Mustang GT350H, which is the, th uh, the Hertz edition, which was for like the car company, like the. So that's going to be a 289, has eh, 200 plus, hor like 230 horsepower is what this engine would make when the stock one would make 40. So, yep, it's going to be pretty interesting. Yep, so that goes on in there and looks really cool. Let me see if I can set it in there. Actually, nah, I can't get it in there. Sorry about that. But, yep, that's pretty much an update. So thanks. Bye.